bit of rainfall moving through overnight and still tracking some showers right now across the region. Scattered showers with us throughout much of today. We will see some dry time by tonight into Friday morning, but by Friday afternoon tracking the next round of rain on the way. Some of the heaviest rain that we see here over the next few days will likely fall Friday night and into early Saturday morning. Finally, by Saturday afternoon, most of that rain should be exiting, shaping up to be a pretty nice end to the weekend, but right now still tracking quite a bit of rainfall, especially into southern Illinois right now, where the heaviest rain continues to fall from Mount Vernon eastward over near Wayne City and Fairfield, and then southward right now over near McLeansboro as well. A couple more showers moving through parts of Gallatin County, southward over near Hardin County, and then back to the west, closer to the Mississippi River, save Kincaid Lake over near Murfreesboro, picking up on some light rain still, and some of the heavier showers also still moving through parts of western Kentucky, through parts of Graves County, just to the south and west there of Mayfield along the Purchase Parkway, lifting to the north and east. Right now, the driest areas are actually out across parts of southeast Missouri as the area of low pressure itself inches closer and closer to our region, but still lots of wet weather here this morning. As you head out the door this morning, may want to pack along an umbrella. It is a little breezy as well. Winds initially are going to be out of the south and east. We'll turn more towards the north and west by this afternoon. Temperatures into the low to mid 50s right now. 53 in Mount Vernon, 54 in Harrisburg and Carbondale, 54 as well in Paducah and 57 right now in Portageville, Missouri in the Missouri Boot Heel. Big time thunderstorms through parts of the deep south and lots of heavy rain as well. We're getting in on the northern side of this storm system, so we're on the cool side. We're not talking about severe weather, but that area of low pressure is going to track almost right over top of our region here as we head into the afternoon hours. Still dealing with quite a few scattered showers about 3 p.m. here. Still scattered showers moving through temperatures into the lower 60s. We'll get on the backside. Winds will turn out of the north and west and clear out the rain as that storm system exits to our east. By 9 p.m., most areas starting to dry out. We'll catch some dry time through early Friday morning, but notice here, this is 7 a.m. The showers can already be seen out to the west, and here they are spreading eastward throughout Friday afternoon. Out ahead of the rain Friday, it is going to be a warm day. Temperatures back in the lower 70s. However, once the rain moves in, temperatures, of course, slipping back, and notice the heaviest rain then pushing through late Friday night, and then first thing on Saturday morning, and another storm system going to track almost right over top of us by Saturday afternoon. That one starting to exit as winds go back out of the north and west and some slightly cooler air pushes back in. Again, the heaviest rain thus far has fallen across the Boot Hill in Missouri. Still through Saturday, we expect an additional one to two inches of rain here across parts of southern Illinois and much of southeast Missouri. Western Kentucky a little less, maybe three quarters of an inch up to about an inch and a quarter still possible in some of those areas. But notice the rain chances today there is going to be some dry time in between the showers, but still scattered showers around almost all day long by this evening. That's when we expect the rain to finally come to an end. By midnight, it's out of here. We'll start to see some breaks in the clouds, and you may actually wake up on Friday morning with a few peaks of sunshine. So rain chances next three days. Again, scattered showers today. We'll see that break as we head into Santa on Friday morning, but then by Friday afternoon and Friday evening, our rain chances ramping back up, and they stick with us through Saturday morning before by Saturday evening all of the rain rain is out of here and then by Sunday some sunshine returning temperatures back in the low 60s Monday we jump back close to 70 degrees dry weather sticks around through Monday we've got more showers in the forecast though for Tuesday possibly a few thunderstorms and some of that wet weather may even stick around into the middle of next week